what are the biggest disadvantages of using Amazon RDS SQL Server instead of EC2? RDS is like hiring Amazon to be your DBA. And DBA, you know, we kind of jokingly say that DBA stands for don't bother asking. Like, you want something, but don't bother asking the DBA because they're going to say no. Well, having Amazon RDS or Azure SQL DB or Google Cloud SQL is like having someone else be your DBA. They're going to say, nope, you can't have that. Nope, you can't have that. Specific cumulative updates, latest versions, um, SA, literally the login SA, you're probably not going to be allowed to have that. You'll have something similar, but not quite SA. Um, but also uh, sketchy database features. And I'll give you an example, synchronous cross-region replication. If you want to have your primary data center in U.S. East and your secondary data center in U.S. West 